And we are back. Welcome to Good Energy. We report on tennis. Good Energy reporting on tennis. No, that's not Chun Li from Street Fighter, ladies and gentlemen. That's the best tennis player in the world. That's right. That's Anz Jabur, an inspiration to an entire country. That's right. 12 million in population, not too far from the Mediterranean Sea. Anz Jabur is inspiring everyone and she loves the kids ladies and gentlemen Anja Burr loves the kids and listen Anja Burr she might listen I might even make a tennis comeback she's she's so inspirational Anja Burr does not have to play another tennis match in her life she's a hall of famer she can stop playing tennis today right now retire after this match Anja Burr is a hall of famer ladies and gentlemen she is phenomenal Anja Burr, in my opinion, is the best and most skilled tennis player on tour. Without a doubt, Anja Burr is the most skilled tennis player on tour. Championships, look, sometimes they just don't mean anything when the draw is as weak as it's been lately. Anja Burr is the best out there. Do not get it twisted. She is the best. Now, she's going to be taking on Rodina right here. And listen, I don't know, Rodina, I don't know if you want to call her a veteran, if her best days are behind her. We saw her best performances, 2008 Wimbledon, long time ago, ladies and gentlemen. But the winner of this is going to take on Claire Lou. And I don't know why Claire Lou has so many haters, okay? Claire Lou was big time as a junior. A lot of you guys don't know that. She set records as a junior. She's big time. She's just going through a slump. I don't think she's healthy. Her fans are in the comments telling me she's healthy. I don't think she is. Because she's big time and she hasn't been playing like it. But nonetheless, guys, we are here in the motherland. And Anja Burr, the number one seed here, number two on tour. It's a shame she didn't get her points at Wimbledon. What a robbery, okay? What a robbery. But the reality here is this, ladies and gentlemen. Next year, because of not getting the points at Wimbledon and doing so well at the U.S. Open, Anja Burr has an entire year where she's going to be at the top of the rankings. Yes, that's what happens when you do well at the U.S. Open, the last major of the year, and you just make so many final appearances. Anja Burr is going to have an entire year where she's basically ranked two. She doesn't have to worry about the start of the year. She could even do well at the Australian Open. It's not going to affect her rankings. <laughs> you know what I mean? So Anja Burr's got it made for 2000 in 23 and get ready ladies and gentlemen i'm excited for what she's gonna do because i'm a huge fan uh, i think she's the most skilled player on tour and this is a match here where look i said last match she can't come into this match against rodina who's playing amazing tennis by the way her confidence uh don't be fooled by her ranking her ranking is 500 i don't care about that she's she's a top 50 player any day she's having a great run here she's won a ton of matches in a row Anja Burr, just clean up the first serve and the second serve, keys to victory. Look, just average what you do, okay? 70% first serve, get your first balls in play, 70%. Your return games, win 30% of them, and you're going to win the match. It's as simple as that. But I don't think Rodina's going to go out without a fight. But, of course, I'm rolling with Anja Burr all day, every day. She's the best player on tour, the most skilled player on tour. She can hit you from a, a drop shot from the baseline, a slice right after a forehand when you least expect it, an overhead volley. Oops, you didn't see that coming. The top spin, there's no way you're going to return it because she just hit a slice out of the blue. Anja Burr is the best, and she's big time, baby.